today I am going to show you how to make an easy broccoli project and here are the materials. This project is really simple, you just need to condition a dark green and a lighter green polymer clay. Let's start making the stalk and stem. Roll the light green clay to a snake and then slice it between 8 to 10 mm long. Use a cocktail stick to hold the stalk. This will be much easier to shape the stalk and also add the stems. Use a dotting tool to create a vertical line around the stalk. And then next, roll another light green clay to a snake. This time, roll and cut it smaller than the stalk. This will be our stem. Place the stalk on top of the sponge before attaching the stems. The sponge will keep the form of your stalk. You can attach as many stems as you like, but here I just attached four. Next, roll another light green clay to a very thin snake and slice the clay thinly. We are going to use these thin slices to decorate the stalk. Attach the thin slices on the side of the stalk. After that, pre-bake and let it cool. Now let's add the florets. Roll the dark green clay into bowls in several sizes. Before you add the florets, fill the hole of your stalk with the light green clay. And then place the biggest bowl in the center, then surround the big bowl with the smaller ones. To create the broccoli florets, use a needle tool or a um, cocktail stick to lightly poke the green. Here I am using a needle tool as well as feather wire texture brush. I started creating texture on the bottom part and working my way to the top. Once you are done, bake the clay completely and let it cool. Once it is cool, you can add shadings to your broccoli. I use watered-down dark green acrylic paint to add the darker shades on the stalk and also on the florets. And lastly, let the paint dry and seal it with matte varnish. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Have fun working on your project and see you next Saturday. Bye-bye and have a great day.